the, the heads and the tails together because you know you, you separate the or you can you can separate the distillation yep like the first part comes out you know it's not so great and the middle part is supposed to be the good part and then the last part's not <laughs> have you done any fruit mixes yet I did, I did throw some apples in and like some pumpkin pie spice and some of it. Oh, don't do the spices. Do, um, what you do is you pack a whole fucking jar, smash a bunch of cherries into it, or smash a bunch of, um, strawberries, anything you want. Peaches are my favorite. Oh yeah, my God. That would be good. Peach, peach moonshine, and it sits for like three months. Oh, uh, longer than three months if you want, but three months is minimum. And yeah. that shit is the bomb of the diggity part. <laughs> I feel like I'm raping a 20 year old. The water, the water <laughs> like, what, now, what did you just <laughs> fucking say? How many more fucking edit points am I going to get in this fucking episode? Holy shit balls. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna fucking play your head like a goddamn orchestral bell, you motherfucker. Stop that shit. <laughs> you crazy fucker. How many Bud Lights you had tonight? No shit. You're Bud Lighting it up. He's probably drinking whiskey and moonshine on the side. I got Miller Light and. Oh, there a we big go. old bottle of fucking full of bourbon. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. There, I don't fuck around. There, there's the culprit right there. <laughs> this is a fucking danger zone fucking bottle. It looked like a bottle of fucking Lysol. I thought it was Lysol at first and you were fucking around, but I'm like, oh, so, shit. This is, this is the, the bomb, dude. I'm sure. Probably, For the probably, smaller bottle, it's fucking 35 bucks. Probably cleans better than Lysol, You get half Lysol of that too. fucking bottle for 35 bucks. This one's 52 bucks. So this one will last me like two weeks. Two weeks. It's, it's good to be ambitious, man. It's good. And when I'm not drinking that, I'm, do, I'm drinking the Glen Levitt. <laughs> there you go. The left hand doesn't know what the right hand is doing. What in the world? So, for goodness sake. Because this is going nationwide. <laughs> well, it's worldwide. It's a fan. Worldwide, bro. And you're a patriotic American person. I advise you right now. I hope you already have a set of balls. Hands and style. I hope you have a ham radio. When shit is fan, any channels. But there's a lot of channels you can look up right now that are important. Also, I would like to implore all my youth and citizens. <laughs> Which is, and we all meet at our local fairgrounds. There's Apple parking. Hopefully, we have American cops that are there to help with parking and or smart American people. Or the, the UN troops will be there to, to, <sighs> to usher you I'm going to take a goddamn football and plant blue and fucking put a bunch of holes in it. <clears throat> The troops will be there to usher you right into the incinerator yeah. immediately. No waiting. Right into the camel parade. No waiting. Don't slap Zyklon me. Don't slap me. Zyklon I said don't slap me. Don't slap me. Zyklon C. Zyklon C <laughs> followed by the incinerator right this way. You know, streamline you right in. No problem. No waiting. Come on. Come I on. Come on. I had a fucking 1,200 pound horse fucking push into me today. And I pushed her, and she almost fell over. Dude, it's hilarious. <laughs> a cow? What a hard left turn, you Glenn Levitt motherfucker. Not my a cow, horse. it's my horse. A horse? My cows are bitches. <laughs> cows are fucking crazy. What the? That sounds like some country fun. It's awesome, dude. I love, I love it, and I hate it. <laughs> Last 24 hours, geez, and right. Actually, last fucking 
Jeez. thousand hours is crazy. See, like, I was thinking about it earlier. Picking. I was like cleaning out that cat litter box. <laughs> it's, it's I got like, cat litter boxes too to clean, bitch. Yeah, and I was like, I was like, damn, this thing smells. I was like, and I fantasized about having like a cattle ranch. I was like, you know, if I can't handle cleaning out uh, like, uh, cat uh, litter uh, box, uh, there's no way I can uh, run a cattle uh, ranch. Like, fuck no. <laughs> right? I'd be like, most of my so time I'm, is spent shoveling shit. So I got two giant fucking heifers here, and I got. I'm, I had a record year on getting people adopted out last year. I call my horses people. So I got a lot of my horses adopted last year. And I'm like, what if you in an adoption, or not adoption, uh, foster care? Record year. We went from 100 horses down to, I'm down, I'm still working it. I'm down to fucking 28 horses right now. And I got four mules. I got twelve freaking hogs. Actually, I got four hogs, and I got five. Like um, one, two, three, four, five. Is this close? Is this on your property? Pig, I got six pot belly pigs, four hogs, four mules, twenty-six horses. And I shaved the fan, and I'm already afraid of what the freaking pizza and that food. You ever eat food now out? My restaurant's is safe ish, because I'm not harm percent sure what's going into it. But when I eat fast food, I feel like fucking shit. Oh, yeah, I can't eat it. I fucking I suffer the consequences. Oh, I think I mean, we've yeah. been. Oh, I, oh, no more of that bullshit. Of course I think right now the fucking vaccine shit they're giving people is adding to it. Oh, yeah, yeah, it'll take it'll take you out if you're not up the par, man. I got get you. the shot. Oh, but it doesn't mix with Burger King. Oh, <laughs> fuck. <laughs> oh. Extra large Dr Pepper. Fucking bam, done. <laughs> Aspartame. Don't oh! even get the fucking test, man. That test has got the fucking goddamn old shit that that's in the uh, antifreeze that gives you cancer. Yummy. Unless the fucking clean swab, dry swab that they pull out the fucking bamboo stick with cotton and they stick mm-hmm. it in my nose and a little bit. I'll take a Q-tip out of a brand new goddamn box and give you my test. But guess what? The way they test right now, normally when they spin that fucking little thing, little vial fucking that's got the fluid in, it's like 100 RPM. Normally. BPR test. They spin this thing at fucking 10,000 RPM. You realize what you can find? I can take swamp water that I just pissed in and it'll show you everything. Anything you want to find in the world, it'll show up. They are fucking these sh- fucking goddamn. I love how my fucking cigarette smoke's going with fucking mass fucking clouds. <laughs> but honestly, so you will find okay. any fucking thing you want to find. You'll find <laughs> frog steaming in the fucking damn thing. Yeah, I did. I did. Part- that. Particle fucking testing is particle testing. They they. The theory of the old Star Trek shit, which I hate Star Trek now. I used to love it, but now it just pisses me off because it brainwashes people and being stupid and thinking there are fucking aliens and blah, blah, blah. The fucking goddamn fucking thing is that their theory that they were showing off that wasn't their theory is a bunch of really famous scientists' theory that you can take, if you had a way to suck particles in the air, which aren't enough, in one room, you would put two in one fucking room to make it happen. But you can make a hammer up here with the right digitizing DNA fucking sizing machine. Was that on Star Trek? Could possibly be a possibility. Instant but hammer. It would be fucked up if they did it because it would fuck everything up. 
Cheetah's story. Don't fuck yeah, with just, my language. Just, like, the, there's a popular meme right now. And people that wear red, it's like a red shirt meme. I don't know if you've seen it. But I guess on a certain Star Trek episode, there was a... Those are the ones that all, all die. They all put masks on because there's some toxin in the air. And the only guy that doesn't is wearing a red shirt. So now all the, the maskers are calling people the red shirts if they don't wear a mask. They're like using it as like a... It's stupid. The mask. I just heard the about maskers it. and the spreaders. So yeah, I can imagine the red that. Shirt people. Don't share it. Don't don't let them get more hype on it. Because right next to my bar, it was, back. Okay. it was stupid. Right next door to my bar, it was not. It it kills me. It completely kills me. It completely kills 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 kills, kills me. It is Lauren Underwood's Democratic Office. <laughs> uh, honestly, in our same building. They snuck in two years ago. They said, we want to have a party of this many people. They didn't say what it was at all. Oh, I almost went to jail that thing. Because I had no clue there. Now, what they did was, is a small footage, tiny office hole that's in our community and it was called cosmic comics so the up on top of, of the building this is cosmic comics it was a it was a comic store big bookstore for like a year and it failed because hell we had fucked them fucked them and they sucked they were idiots what? so what these guys now? come in they wreck the store what? after these guys go away. They never fucking change the fucking sign. They're so cheap. The sign I stop is still Cosmic Comics for fucking two fucking years. These guys been here. So every time I get a chance, I fucking put a twelve point fucking sticker on their fucking window. Or if it's <laughs> their windows get dirty, if their windows get dirty, I fucking do a little heart. Trump loves you. <laughs> The other day, I bought a fucking little travel fucking pillow fucking from um, my pillow guy. And inside, this is a fucking, guy? it was like, I don't know, 8 by 11 fucking regular standard thing. But it had this picture on it and all this stuff. Support us, blah, blah, blah. Did you say from and my I pillow guy? I happened to have double sticky what tape fuck? fucking in my car. So I fucking put it on the back and fucking... Reached up as highly good. This took oh, there for like three days. Sake. It was awesome. <laughs> I gotta keep smoking. I put a on Pelosi one that that was they only the last three days. If it wasn't next to my fucking my the pillow, restaurant I my pillow with, guy. It, I, I bought a pillow for my pillow guy. What the fuck? Not to mention how many times I spit on a fucking doorknob. So what do they do there? It's just, it's just their office for their campaigning or their bullshit? Well, during last year's election, I got pictures of a lady manipulating stuff. But that will be brought up later. Hey. You guys. <laughs> this dude's fucked up. I need you fucking to butthole. Out. I don't want to hear this fucking shit. We're pausing on the attack. We're at 59.25. Let's decide. What do you want to fucking do? <laughs> so at this point... It's 4.901. What do you want to talk about? Good, but not the best. <laughs> this is the ultimate... This is the ultimate costume of shame for the younger generations. They could not handle this. Number two, good but not the best. That's like fucking time to commit Hari Kari and shit. Yeah. Like, fuck my
my mommy. Oh.